Hey, good morning, friends. Here's the opening to Peter's first letter. Uh, and there they begin uh, with the name of the writer, Peter, an apostle, a sent one, one who is sent of King Jesus to, writing to God's elect, those who were uh, chosen by God, exiles. Uh, these people are exiles in two different ways. They are physical exiles. They are uh, a people who are, because of their faith, because they are following Jesus, they're no longer welcome in their home. <laughs> and so, uh, but also they are exiles because they have given their allegiance to Jesus. They are no longer citizens of earth. They are, they are away from their home. They are in exile, away from their home, which is the kingdom of heaven. To God's elect, exiles scattered throughout the provinces. And these are certain places, Pontus, uh, Galatia, Cappadocia, Asia, Bithynia, who have been chosen according to the foreknowledge of God the Father, through the sanctifying word of the Spirit, to be obedient to King Jesus and sprinkled with his blood. And here's the line, grace and peace be yours in abundance. See, it is, uh, we are blessed to be in uh, in God's family, right? and that, that may or may not mean a material blessing, but what it most definitely means is to be blessed with grace and with peace in our lives today. Who comes to mind right now that you could ask our Father to bless with grace and peace today? Father, we yield to you today that you, uh, that our, uh, we find our whole selves. We understand ourselves. We find our identities only in you, in being uh, your sons, your daughters, in being um, servants of our King Jesus. And we surrender to you. And we ask that you fill us, fill us today with an abundance of your grace and your peace. Amen. Grace and peace, friends.